The Norman Police Department releases body cam footage tonight from the night an officer arrested a local business owner. Shannon Hanchett owns the Cookie Cottage in town and died at the Cleveland County Jail last Thursday. Fox 25's David Chazanoff watched the video and heard reaction from city leaders tonight. David, what did you see? Dan and Wendy, just from watching the video, you could tell Shannon was very worried for her children's safety. City leaders we heard from tonight tell us that officers could have done a much better job with her situation. The address of your emergency. I am at. This is Officer Crawford. Yeah, go ahead. She's misusing 911. You can hang up. I'm here with her. All right. Thank you. I'll call them again. You don't say anything. Body camera footage shows Shannon at an AT&T store calling 911 multiple times. Shannon, you're under Sir? arrest. I'm not under arrest. You are. Moments later, she insists on staying at the store until it closes. When? Oh my God! Oh my God! Stop. Please! Stop. Stop. <laughs> Norman Council Member Brandy Studley saw the police report from that night and shared a section with residents Tuesday. Upon arrival, I contacted the defendant who was exhibiting behavior that was consistent with some type of mental health disorder. The rest of the report is irrelevant. Studley says the arresting officer should have contacted a mental health professional to evaluate Shannon's situation. Our system and city policies have once again failed us. Shannon's death 12 days later at the Cleveland County Jail inspired Studley to make this request to her fellow council members so something like this never happens again. That adding to the agenda so we can vote on the formation and funding of a local crisis response unit. And Studley made this request for Norman's next council meeting in January of 2023. Now, other residents did speak at this meeting. Most were in support, while others had their doubts. Reporting live in Norman, David Chazanoff, Fox 25 News.